probably the most expensive mirror I've ever seen here. This rug, oh my gosh. But I did pick up a few items, so I wanted to do a little bit of a home goods haul. These make the best charcuterie boards ever. All of the engraving and carving on this is incredible. Hello everyone, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando. I make all shopping and shop with me videos, home decor and DIY home decorating videos. I love shopping at all my favorite stores like Target, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Kirkland's World Market, Pottery Barn, Hobby Lobby, pretty much any store that sells home goods. I love shopping there. I just am so honored and love to be your eyes and shop with you in the stores to show you what is new, sales and clearance deals, and tons of seasonal decor. If you love DIY room transformations, we have a bunch of those on my channel as well. We did just move into a brand new house and I am transforming every single room space by space and taking you along on the process. So if you love any of the stores I just mentioned, if you love shop with me videos or DIY room transformations, you will absolutely love it here. So please be sure to give the video a thumbs up before we get into it. Hit the subscribe button down below and the notification bell so that you can be notified every single time I post a new video. But today we are shopping at Home Goods. I don't even think I said that yet. We're gonna be shopping at Home Goods, checking out a little bit from every section, but of course, looking at a lot of furniture, decor, and just whatever else Home Goods has for us today. I like doing these videos pretty often so you can get a good idea of what you could potentially find at a Home Goods near you. So if you love Home Goods and you're excited to see what they have this week, then just stay right where you are because we're gonna head inside right now. Of course, as always, we're gonna start in the furniture section and it is packed today. I'm already seeing some really awesome furniture pieces. Like look how absolutely packed this is. It goes like all the way up this way and all the way up that way and you can barely walk between it. So let's take a look at some of the stuff they have. They have a few huge like oversized mirrors over here in the furniture section. This one's 300. I love how it has that like I forget what it's called, but it's like that like boning tile. It's really, really pretty. I love the black and white geometric, super beautiful like statement mirror. You could use this in like a bedroom or a living room space. This is 300 and like I said, it is absolutely massive. So I'm sure you can see the even bigger mirror that's on the other side of this one. Look at this, this is funky. This is $600. This is probably the most expensive mirror I've ever seen here. It's really pretty. It kind of has this like purpley bluish pattern. It's really huge. Kind of looks like a geode almost and it's kind of those colors but it's more of like an ornate pattern if you look closely. So this is definitely a statement mirror as well. I'm in love with these chairs. I love the staining of the wood. I love the super sleek lines, the rounded edges, and the linen color and the linen color of the cushion. These are on clearance actually for $135 a piece, which is not bad at all. If you needed two accent chairs for like a reading nook or like a formal living room, these are such a great find. I'm in love. This coffee table is so awesome. I don't love like the red. It's a very, very red toned wood. It has caning on the bottom and then on the top, it has something I've never seen before in a coffee table. It's like ribbed and that's not just the way it looks, it's actually the way that it feels. This glass you can pop out, so I feel like it'd still be pretty easy to clean. There's definitely a lot going on design-wise with this coffee table, but it's a super unique home goods find and I had to show it to you. This credenza is $5.99, it's so pretty, I love. All the little finishing details, like the molding on the doors, all the different levels of the doors, even the molding on the front of this. The color is really pretty as well. It's like a darkish blue teal. Like it definitely has a little bit of green in it, but look at all the graining you can still see of the wood. Also obsessed with this hardware. It's like a dark gold, but it's ribbed kind of like that coffee table we were just looking at. These open up so there's some hidden storage and then you could put some really nice baskets right here. This is so beautiful. I also really love this credenza. This one is like way more modern. It's like a white with gray undertones. You can still see the graining of the wood and then it has this really sleek black hardware right up at the top tons of great storage here it also has black legs has four cabinets this is a really good like media console you could also use it as like a buffet sideboard credenza and this is 800 they have the same thing right here in like a gray toned wood so it's more of 
like a cool tone but it is still wood undertones if that makes sense i feel like it looks really really gray in the video it's kind of like a grayish taupey color this is the exact same as the last one it is 800. wow look at this one the hardware is similar on this one to the last two that we saw but look at the design this is like a handcrafted in india piece all of the engraving and carving on this is incredible. I also love the color, love the graining of the wood. You can kind of like see through because those are like straight holes in there, but I still feel like it's pretty covered that you could get some great storage space out of this. And if it bugged you at all, you could use baskets in there, but honestly it's dark in there. So it just looks black. This is so beautiful just to give you more of a close-up on this it kind of has like maybe a little bit of a whitewash over it but wow this is beautiful and i love how they have this hardware on the top to modernize it a bit this is 600. look at this little cork i don't know if it's an accent table or a little seat but it's meant to be like a cork this is so adorable <laughs> it's actually made out of like cork material it's actually made out of cork material and it's pretty heavy as well. This is a fun find. This little blue cabinet right here for 159 would be a great bathroom cabinet if you need some more bathroom storage. I feel like you could put like beautifully folded towels and cute little like woven containers or whatever kind of containers you would like with other like must have toiletries for guests or something. It's really, really skinny. So if you don't have a ton of space, this is great vertical storage. Um, where was this like last year? This is like the exact entryway type table that I was looking for. The color of it is literally so perfect. It's like a warm toned, like creamy white, but it's still, no, sorry, not warm tone. Like it has warm tones from the fact that it is wood, but it's more of a cool toned piece. I love the caning. I love the two half circles that open it and the intricate design on the doors. This is literally perfection another handcrafted in india item no one's surprised i always seem to gravitate towards those this is 250 dollars. oh my gosh i really want to get it but like we already have an entryway table coming up in the next like couple weeks i'm going to be doing another like major home updates video where i show you painting more of the house doing little things around the house that i wouldn't do a whole video about like decorating our entryway things that i've just been meaning to do i think it would be fun to show you a bunch of like little projects so get excited for that video coming up in the next few weeks while i'm over in the furniture section i want to show you a couple of rugs i'm loving so i want to show you a couple of the good ones that i have at my home goods this week i really like this one the pattern and kind of like what's going on with it is super subtle because it's not like a stark cream color and it's also like pretty tightly woven which is nice because i feel like it'd be really durable this is the safa Vieja brand i don't ever know if i'm saying that right it is 300 and i really really like it this rug is so beautiful i love the pattern on it i feel like this would be gorgeous for a dining room if you have like a more formal space i really like the colors because i feel like they're pretty subtle but definitely would be a statement rug this is 8 by 10 it looks so huge in person and on camera so i feel like you'd have to have a pretty big dining room but wanted to show you this one i just love like the symmetry how unique it is the border around it and the colors chef's kiss this one is 300 dollars, and the brand is laloi no laloi i don't know let me know down below if you know what it's called. In case you didn't know, you can find tons of Magnolia Home rugs here as well. This one's so pretty and colorful. I feel like if you wanted to add like a really big statement pop, this one is great. I love how all the colors work together. I feel like it'd be so great for any season. This one is, like I said, from Magnolia Home, which is Hearth and Hand, Chip and Joanna Gaines, like from Target. And this is 300. Just in case you didn't know, Magnolia Home is like their overview brand and Hearth and Hand is like an extension of that. Just kind of like Studio McGee is an extension of McGee & Co, which is their like main brand. So the smaller like branches are the ones they have at Target, but you can find their main line items here at Home Goods. This rug, oh my gosh, this is the rug that made me wanted to show you a bunch of rugs. So this is actually by Rifle Paper Company, which is a very, very popular brand. So I'm shocked that their rugs are showing up here at Home Goods. Look at the colors. I'm absolutely obsessed with this. I'm like terrified of putting color in my house, but like I would buy this because it's just so beautiful. Look at the border around it. 
there's just so many details this is another one that is 8 by 10 and this is only $300 that's such a steal for this rug here's another one by Magnolia home super different not something you would expect to see from them this one's actually on clearance for $149 I really really love this rug look at like the beautiful medallions this one is so pretty this one is also super duper soft which is so nice like when you're popping off the couch or whatever to like put your feet down on something really soft this one's really nice I can't believe it's on clearance look at the price difference from 400 down to 150 you can't beat that so there is a bunch of furniture now I just kind of want to make my way around the store show you anything that catches my eye so you can get a good variety of what you could potentially find at a home goods near you this week seriously any day now we're gonna start finding Halloween finds which is so crazy but I remember it was this time last year when I started finding Halloween all of this 4th of July stuff, once it's gone, this will be Halloween in the next few weeks, which is like pfft, crazy to think about. I mean, they do fall stuff here, but I feel like they always have more Halloween decor than fall decor, and I'm so excited to see what they have this year. Oh my goodness, look at these candles. Like this big tray right here has a candle inside of it, and it's all carved. They have smaller ones. They have like a couple different sizes. Holy moly, this is definitely one of the coolest things I've ever found at Home Goods. Look how pretty this is. Here is the smaller size, just for reference, like it's like my entire forearm. It's a really good size. This one is 30. And then they have this one. This is like the whole top of the cart. Like, look how big that is. This one is 80. This is such a statement piece, such a unique Home Goods find. This is a really good shopping trip today. I have seriously never seen anything like this here. It has a bunch of different wicks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven wick candle. Honestly, I feel like this would be more decorative than anything, but you could absolutely burn the candle out and then use this as a tray. And you kind of have like a two-in-one thing going on because you can definitely clean this out after you burn out the wax. This is so beautiful. I feel like $80 is definitely a reasonable price for something like this. It's again another item where I feel like if you found it at Pottery Barn, West Elm, Crate and Barrel, a store like that, like Williams Sonoma, it would be like almost $200. Another absolutely huge one. So many statement candles today. This one is really, really pretty too. This one's only 10. This one's huge. It smells like eucalyptus. Another one where you could like burn the wax out and then use it as like a nice bowl, like a fruit bowl, an entryway bowl. You could put like bowl filler in, like something like this once you get all of the wax out. So I love how you can like continue to enjoy it even after you burn out the candle. And this one's only 35. Looking at those candles made me want to come over and see what trays they have today and look how many they have. Home Goods is definitely one of the best places to come if you need a board because they just have so many different varieties. You can find ones that are more like artistic, like natural wood style, like how this one has like the hole burnt in it. You can see the graining. It has a raw edge. They also have ones that are finished in the middle, but it's kind of like a slice of tree, which is really, really awesome. This is only $12.99. We make such a good gift with like a set of cheese knives and a bottle of wine as like a housewarming gift. Then they do have more polished and refined ones like this. So pretty. Love the rattan wrapped handle. This one is priceless apparently then they have tons that are lazy susans which is my personal preference they'll have more intricate ones like this that have designs they'll have ones that have gold accents and then plain ones all of these are around like 35 dollars these make the best charcuterie boards ever because no matter where someone is standing around an island or a table they can rotate it to grab what they want seriously such a great gift or if it's something that you don't have definitely consider picking one of these up they also have ones that are great cutting boards that kind of have that lip to catch I think it's like juices when you cut meat which sounds pretty disgusting they just have so many different ones you could layer a bunch of the ones that they have here to add a little bit of flair like on your backsplash seriously the options are endless when it comes to cutting boards and serve boards at home goods one of my favorite things to buy at home goods are picture frames and for an upcoming project I need a gallery wall 
frame set or I just need frames to make a gallery wall so I want to check out what they have here sometimes they have these really awesome and affordable sets and the frames are really good quality and typically a good price I have already priced them at Target so I want to see what they have here too I love these ones right here these are what I was looking for the matting is really really nice and this is how you can kind of arrange them if you have like one set two set three sets so I really love these ones I think square is what I want to go for so they have ones with matting they also have ones without matting you can get all three frames for $24.99 so super good when you break the price down and the quality is a lot better than the ones I was looking at at Target so I'm gonna see if I can get my hands on three sets of these look at these hampers or these like baskets they have like the sage green on the top which comes right off these are $80 they're a really good size it might be hard to tell because they're like on the shelf but they're really big and these just like lift right off with this really pretty sage green top oh my gosh I'm in love okay super pumped to see another name brand item we already saw the rifle paper co rug which I feel like is a great find and now there's a bunch of hydro flasks and these are in really fun summer colors they have this like pale baby yellow they also have like a hot pink they have a bright orange they also have blue down there they have a bunch of different sizes the biggest one which is this one is $24.99 and then they have a smaller one for $20 it's fun that these are in summer colors it's a lot cheaper than if you bought them directly from hydro flask and they do sell different tops so if you want like a straw top you can buy that on amazon kind of like a convertible top these are so nice i wanted to quickly peek at the clearance and see if i found anything that caught my eye i'm seeing a lot of pillows that would be perfect for fall decor yes i am already planning my fall decor and like a pillow like this is so, so perfect. I need to find a price on here. So this is $18. I love the detailing and the colors. If you do orange for your home decor, this would be so perfect for the fall. These little olive pillows are really pretty, not necessarily for the fall, but just for right now. There's like this orange poof that is $40. Here's another pillow that would be super great. There's so many, like not even just for the fall. That's just kind of like specifically what I have in mind. But there's these great throw blankets. You can find awesome storage baskets. Definitely make sure you are checking your home goods clearance because you can find some awesome stuff in here. They have sheet sets. They also have, yeah, like look at this. Tahari Wash Linen Blend Relaxed Casual Queen sheet set this is so nice and it's in a white neutral color this is 50 and it was 60 they have another one behind it in like a dusty pink color you can also find super useful stuff like rug pads this is only 12 bucks they have a bunch of different sizes you can just cut them to fit whatever rug that you need they have some awesome soaps as well this comes in oh it looks like goss bottle but it's actually plastic this is six bucks but they have some really great hand soaps honestly you can make like a little gift for somebody in here obviously take off the clearance stickers but you could do like a soap soap and then you could do like a throw blanket they have a couple different throw blankets here's one it is so comfy this is only $12 they have a couple different colors in that you could also throw in a set of hand towels they have a ton of options right here that are all on clearance you can find awesome stuff in your clearance section at home goods easily make a birthday gift a housewarming gift for somebody in your life so take the opportunity to check your clearance section because there's a chance you could save even more money than you do just by shopping at home goods in general and still find awesome stuff Alrighty, I just got back into my car. I actually met a subscriber today, which was so fun. I believe her name was Carla. I'm horrible with names, so I pray that I got that right. But it was super nice to meet you. If you guys ever see me out, definitely feel free to say hi. I love meeting you guys. But I did pick up a few items, so I wanted to do a little bit of a home goods haul. Nothing too crazy, but I did pick up three sets of these gallery wall mirrors one of them was actually on clearance so this one's $18 it has a little bit of like a nick right here but it's totally fine you're not going to notice it when it's up but these are really nice so I got three sets of those so there will be nine frames in the place that I intend to use them you will know really really soon so I got three sets of those they were 24 each but one of them was 18 which is a really really good deal they honestly feel like such good quality and you can see they have like 
like a light wood graining if you look up super close. They also come in gray, they come in white, and they also come in gold, and you can find like light wood ones. They also have different shapes. I was specifically looking for square, um, but I am just really excited about these. I think they're gonna look so good. I'm super excited to get them hung up, and I'm just really excited about the project that we're working on right now, and I can't wait to share it with you. There's just so much that's going into it, but it's a like a true transformation. Like it's gonna look so good. It already does look so good. And then the other thing that I picked up is much less exciting and glamorous. I got a bunch of dog bags in two different colors. So this brand right here, it's MK, it's Modern Canine. You can find them on Amazon. I'll link them down below. These are the only dog bags I will buy. This brand is so good. We have three dogs, if you didn't know. So we go through a lot of dog bags and these are just the only ones that I like, the only ones I will buy. They have like kind of a smell to them, like a pleasant smell. They're thick that like your nails aren't gonna go through them. They rip super easily at the perforation. These are just the perfect dog bags, which I know is not gonna like apply or matter to a lot of you, but if you have ever wondered what are the best dog bags in the entire world, it's these. They are amazing. At Home Goods, you can find them for super cheap, so these packs are $4.99. They're pretty reasonable on Amazon as well, so I will have them linked, like I said, and they just come in so many fun colors. I just love them so much. So that is everything I picked up at Home Goods today. Three sets of the frames, four things of dog bags, so just, you know, really exciting things happening over here, but I still wanted to show you because I thought that you guys might be interested in seeing it. Like I've said, I'm trying to be better with showing you purchases that I'm making, but you will see these frames pop up again in a future home decor haul for a transformation. But that is going to be it for me. I love you all so much. I really hope that you enjoyed shopping with me at Home Goods. I hope that you got a good idea of what you could potentially find at a Home Goods near you. If you have anything you specifically want to see in my next Home Goods video, please feel free to leave it down below. I'm always open to making sure that I'm hitting up all the different sections and giving love to all of them so that everybody can see something that they are interested in. Definitely be sure to let me know down below what was your favorite item I showed in today's video. Mine has to be that rug, the Rifle Paper Co. rug or the pineapple basket was really good too there was also a bunch of really good furniture it was just a really good shopping day at home goods i just love when that happens i feel like when you go in with no or really low expectations you have a really good day so i hope that you guys have a beautiful day a beautiful shopping day i hope you guys are having a wonderful saturday i love you all so much if you haven't yet please be sure to give the video a thumbs up hit the subscribe button down below and the notification bell so you don't miss all of my future videos and my next room transformation and yeah that's gonna be it for me i love you all so much i'll see you next time bye guys